Hello dear students of class 3 I would like to welcome you all for the science class as I want to say that you people are very lucky why? because you know that we are made in, in the image of God so we should be very very grateful and thankful to the Lord the Almighty who has made the human being as same like in the image of the God. So you need to be very happy for that. And when I talk about the image of God, that means the topic or the chapter that we are going to deal is the second chapter and the title of the chapter is Human Body. Yes. And you can see the different pictures here. Here are the pictures of the skeletal system. Here are the, the you can call uh, um, nerves. Okay, there are so many nerves. Here the internal organs. I can see the muscular system. So many things you can see in this picture. For that, as you know that human body is made of many organs. Can be an internal or external organ. Along with we have a many organ systems. Just before I show you the picture where it shows the respiratory system and the skeletal system, we have a muscular system, digestive system and excretory system. These are the five systems of a human body. But today we are going to discuss only about internal organ where you can see which are the internal organs in these pictures. Okay? We have the brain. We have a heart, we have a stomach, we have a kidney, so on. And internal organ. Now, what is internal organ? Internal organs are the organs that we find inside our body. Let me read for you all. Our body consists of several organs and organ system that performs one or more functions. Okay? We have got so many organ and organ system which functions one or more functions. These organs are located at the different places in the human body. Okay? As you all know, the internal organs are located inside the body and within the skin. Internal organ is located inside our body and within the skin. And here, these organs are protected by layers of skin, fats, and bones. These layers these organs are protected. Internal organ is protected, protected by the layers of skin, uh, fats, and bones. We will see the internal organ that we have in here is heart. Okay? You can pronounce in that way heart. As we saw the symbol by doing this, you know, when we talk about heart. Okay, now. The human heart is muscular organ about the size of a close fist, okay? And that pumps the blood through the body. It supplies the blood throughout the body. And the main function here, it supplies oxygen, nutrients to the tissues and removes carbon dioxide and other waste. This is the main function uh, of a heart. And I suggest you all to open your textbook and underline this line which you have in the in the, in the main for the main function of this heart. And it is located in the chest cavity, slightly towards the left side. And it is protected by the cage of ribs. Okay, rib cage. And do you and uh, it is said that our heart beats one lakh times in a day. Okay? These are the facts of the heart. And then you have to know the function of heart. Okay? The next organ into organ that we have discussed is our human brain. Now, what is the function of the brain? The brain is the main controlling unit of the human body. And it is located inside the human body. It is very delicate and it is protected by the skull. That is a hard bony structure. And the main function of the 
ways to help us to think and sends message to different parts of the body and tells the tells them what to do. The main function of the brain is to think. It sends the message to different part of the body. Next, we are going to discuss about only stomach. Okay? These are all that is system, but today we are going to discuss only about stomach. Muscular bag located on the left side of, of the upper abdomen and the stomach receives food from the mouth to the windpipe and the main function of the stomach. In the stomach, the food is churned and get mixed with the digestive juice and breaks down into the simpler form. The food which enters inside from the mouth. Through the food pipe, when it reaches to the stomach, it gets churned. Okay? Same in fluid. Okay? Then, it is, with the help of the digestive juice, the food gets churned and it breaks down the food into the simpler form. So, this is the main function of stomach. Next, the internal organ that we will discuss is liver. You can see the picture of liver. And what is the function of liver? The liver is the largest, remember that, is the largest internal organ of the body. It is located on the right side of the abdominal cavity. And it is protected by the lower, lower, since it is located in the right side, it is protected by the lower right ribcage. And the main function of the liver is it filters harmful substances from the blood and stores the energy in the form of glycogen. This is the main function of liver. It removes the harmful substances from the blood and stores the stores the energy in the form of glycogen. And the last but not the least, the topic or uh, the internal organ that we are going to discuss is kidney. You can see the figure of kidney here. The image of kidney is the same like the beans which you eat at home, right? There are two, there are two beans, you have seen the beans, no? Bean shaped organs inside the abdom abdomen that filters the blood into the human body. And the blood is filtered to produce urine through kidney only. The blood is filtered and from the blood, the whatever the waste, the urine comes out from our body. And the kidneys excrete, means ex excrete means remove urine which is a waste product. So, time to recap this. What we have discussed in this, in this video, that is, we have discussed about the human body and the system, the organ and the organ system, internal organ, which we have already discussed just now, their importance and the function related to the heart, brain, stomach, liver and kidneys. So, with this, I want to I want to wind up my class saying that stay stay in be care, be, be safe, stay safe and take care of yourself. Thank you.